this is going to be a quick tutorial video for people that want to create articles which just contain questions and answers and I'm going to deep dive to show you what settings you need in the article creator as well as additional outside settings that you might want to play with. So to begin with you want to create a new article creator task then you need an article keyword. Not all keywords return questions and answers so it's best to use a keyword which is itself a question. So in this example we are using what is green tea. Then you'll notice that you have article size. Now none of these things really matter because you're only using questions and answers. However if you set search results and play around with any of these settings such that it goes to Google and downloads no content you'll find your task will actually fail. So it's best to leave it at default you know 10, 5, 5, one variation and just leave the settings alone. Instead the more important one is where it says create and it drops down the templates. You actually want to scroll down and go down to questions and answers and this will only put questions and answers in your article. Even though it scrapes content from here it's actually not going to insert it into your article. Now the next setting is questions and answers. You need to toggle this to on and you need to select how many questions and answers you want in your article. Now with the newest update to SEM, if you set questions and answers to a ridiculously high number, now when it comes to generating those inserts, it will only run through all the questions and answers it has in its case once, which means you're not going to have to worry about having duplicate questions and answers, which was a problem previously, but now it's fixed. So feel free to up this limit. Now I'm going to save this task and the next setting you want to actually be mindful of is in other settings, search engine settings, Google Q&A query count. By default it's set to 25 and this means that it's going to drill down 25 times to find more questions and answers within the Google search. Now each query count you add puts about two seconds to do overall search time. So 25 means an extra 50 seconds and this will return normally an additional two questions and answers for every query count. So 25 here means I should expect about 50 questions and answers once it's all said and done. If I want more then I increase this number. Let's try 50 and I expect 100 questions and answers. Of course this changes and it's related to the, qu the keyword itself in Google. Going back to my mass article creator, I'm going to hit run now. Okay, once the task has started and I'm looking at the log, it's saying querying Google, which is what we want. It's waiting for questions and answers and it's digging an extra 50 times, which is the setting we placed inside the other settings. And you can see it's doing the operation here, Q&A 1, Q&A 2, 3, 4, 5. Now using the power of YouTube, I'm able to skip ahead and if I scroll down, it's done digging Q&A up to 50 and it's found 83 questions and answers for what is green tea. And it's written my article. If I click on this blue button here, I can preview what's been created. And we can see if we scroll down, a whole bunch of Q&As. And if I were to count them, there's probably 83, which matches the cache 